honestly, Marnie, you are so obsessed with success and who's who and what they have and how they got it. Like I was looking at Tally Schifrin and I was thinking you probably wish that she was your best friend. It's pretty transparent. That way you could tell everybody to tune in to hear your best friend on fresh air. I like being around people who know what they want. People like you? Cause what do you really want other than like a boyfriend with a luxury rental? Seriously, that's where your priorities are. You've always been this way and now it is worse. No, you know what? You are worse. I can't take you anymore. You think everyone in the world's out to humiliate you. You're like a big ugly fucking wound. Adam says you're teetering on the edge of psychotic misery, but you're smiling so wide that no one can tell. You are the wound. I am not a wound. You are a wound. You are the wound. You're the wound. You're the wound. Stop saying that. I am not a wound. You are a wound. Maybe we're overanalyzing this and the issue is just that I've got a boyfriend and you don't and it's as simple as that. That's awesome. That's a really, really mature way of dealing with your fucking feelings. I would back the fuck off if I were you. Oh, I'm fucking terrified. Seriously, I am. I mean, I'm not, but maybe I should be considering you've been batshit crazy ever since Charlie broke up with you. Yeah? Well, you've been crazy since before I even met you. You've been crazy since middle school when you had to masturbate eight times a night to stave off diseases of the mind and body. Okay, that is my most shameful, painful, private secret, and it might sound like a joke, but it's not fucking funny to me, okay? And that's why I told you to never tell anyone. I didn't tell anyone. I wouldn't do that. I'm just telling you now. I would never tell anyone that. I am a good fucking friend. Unlike you, you are a bad friend. Maybe that's not what I care about right now. I don't really give a shit about being a good friend. I have bigger concerns. You know what? Thank you. That is all I needed to hear. I'm done. What is that supposed to mean? I do not want to live here anymore. Not with you. Yo, well, I don't want to live here anymore with you either. And I'm not just saying that because you said it. I was thinking it, but I didn't want to say it because I'm a good friend and you're a bad one. Fine, great, awesome. Very good.